to center stage Star Wave Organic Music Festival, Mr. Ross Takora. Providence. Providence. Make your food be your medicine, and your medicine be your food, Rhode Island. Greetings, everyone. We're out here at the Star Wave Music Festival in Providence, Rhode Island. Yeah, Rastakura Star Wave Organic Festival. Jamaican food versus USA fast food. I mean, genetically manipulated seeds and animal genes incorporated. Come on, man. You ever hear about that thing named beef potato or even pork tomato? With the advent of genetically modified seeds, because we know. 25, 30 years ago, 40 years ago, we never have a problem with GMO, even though people have been experimenting. But you never really have like multinational companies who are actually going to people country and actually force it as the law and the government for them to grow GMO and stop growing their idle organic farm. Yeah man, them have them things they do and no more GM foods, hey Rasta. Be careful of soya beans in the aya. We have to store we own the seeds because the hairs, ganja, stand up. You know? So how do you see, like coming from Jamaica, right? Do you see that there's a movement now intensifying in Jamaica around like the anti-GMOs? Because we know sometimes our politicians can be caught up in, in certain things around the IMF and the World Bank and certain you know, policies that are placed on our countries and yeah. force the imports of, of certain products. There, there is a movement, there is a movement both ways. Mm -hmm. yeah, you have the movement who is importing the products, mm -hmm. and you have the movement that I and I now who is saying no to GMO. Yeah. See? Because just the other day, when I come to the US for the march against Monsanto yes. and GMO products in, uh, in, in, in New, New York, York yes. they also have the march in Jamaica. Oh, right? Okay. It was, I think it was on 25th of, the 25th of, of, of May. Yeah. Right? So there was also a march in Jamaica, coordinated by IRFM, Running African, Andrea Williams, Carbo Mahat. You know, so, you know, there's a movement. But there's a bigger movement that is pushing the GMO. Yeah. Because the, the, the GMO is coming through the government institutions because mm -hmm. RADA, which is the Rural Agricultural Development Agency, them know any, most of the seeds them that them have is GMO because they are imported and they get them yes. free. Yes. So because they get them free now, you know that the things that are free are normal and things that are not really good for human consumption. Exactly. Uh, even though the natural, idle, organic seeds are also free. Yes. And that's the reason why I said that people need to start to practice the exchanging of these seeds. Mm -hmm. Right? And that's the way now how we can stand up and really fight yes. the food war. Yes. It's a food war we and Kura is a survivor again. It's a food for me a fight. I mean, must win. It's a food for me a fight. What well, you think is all the while you'll get dumping? It's a food war. No more starving. The man with the most food, he must win. Did it some more till he sells some more from August Town. Me hear the lion roar, sir. Me pull up the food basket, take it to the market, strictly organic. So the Rasta man plant it. So me plant it. And so me yant it. To be forewarned is to be forearmed. Get yourself a farm. We're not clapping. Round of applause.